One of the things that all of us would be aware of is the fact that what the internet does provide for everyone in, um, in terms of its use is anonymity. So someone could be sitting behind a computer, be chatting with a, was it, um, a child. The, per the person sitting behind that computer could be 20, 30, 40, speaking to a child that is 13 or less, but pretend to be a 13 year old, just to get them into that such conversation. Now, one of the things that a lot of stalkers do, they try to gather much information about the person that they've engaged. Mm -hmm. And one thing that was a 40 year old who's was basically stalking the child would do, or a 20 year old or 30 year old, would gather a lot of information with regards to what children like, kind of things that would entice them to continue that conversation mm -hmm. that um, they've already started with. Now, that for that particular reason, this is seen as a, I could say from, from our perspective, it was when you're investigating the crime, it shows intent of committing a certain kind of crime. And therefore, when the book is thrown at them, if the, the investigations go through and it's found that the person's guilty, they should be able to basically um, face the law to its full maximum if possible. But um, when, when people engage on day to day, basis, even with things like, for instance, um, gaming, you know, a lot of gaming communities, children are not aware of who they're playing with. Mm -hmm. Um, and who they're saying, who they're talking to, and probably because the person's an adult, they're really good at the game, they'll, they'll start with things like, oh, I could teach you two tricks to get more points for your particular um, um, avatar. Those conversations actually would basically draw a child to a particular member of the gaming community that they fall within. I think parents really need to look at it very, um, very seriously, because at every given time, that fact that the internet provides anonymity does tells us that at every given time, we do not know who our children are speaking to when they are basically online. All right. So by this provision, you, have, you are prohibited from using an electronic device or 